everyone, Amy Love here, and I am here today to share with you this little project that I created using some items from bbcraft.com, and I'll have a link to their shop below. We're going to make this little fairy in a bottle. So you're going to want to print out or cut out a fairy um, on cardstock. I wouldn't use paper. And I cut this one out of some packaging, and I made sure that it fit in the jar I was going to use. And then I made sure to leave a tab at the bottom so that um, I could attach her to the cork base. So now I am just using the back of a paintbrush to kind of round my fairy image so that it will fit in the dome better. And I'm using one of the um, glass jar bottles that I got in the assorted pack that has the cork. And you will find a link to those uh, below in the description of this video. So now that I've rounded her with the paintbrush, look at how she fits in there. It's, she's just perfect. She was just the right size. It really worked out well. So now I am going to use that tab that I left on the bottom uh, to attach her to the cork. And I am just going to do that with some hot glue. And it doesn't matter if she wavers um, back and forth because once she is in the jar, that won't happen. And she'll stand up straight and it'll be beautiful. But I want to cover the back of the image, so I'm going to just use a little bit of tool for that. Um, I'm just going to kind of wad it up uh, behind her in the jar so that you won't... It'll, it'll help mute that a little bit. But now, you know, she's going to need a little bit of sparkle. So I'm actually using these um, glitter sequins um, nail art that I got from BB Craft. And I will have a link to them below. It comes in like 12 different colors. I am loving this stuff. It's so shiny. So I'm just going to kind of add that to the um, cork to give some sparkle. But I'm going to make sure to steer clear of the edges so that my glass dome will come down over her. Uh, smoothly and none of that glitter will be in the way. And the color I'm using has kind of um, little bits of purple and silver in it. It's so pretty. I love these little um, mixes. They're so cute. So cute. And every fairy needs a little sparkle. And look at the sparkle on that. Amazing. I'm going to make sure to add some to the front. Super cute. All right, and then once she's dry, you're ready to put her together. So um, she's dry enough. I am just going to tuck some of the tool behind her and then uh, slip the glass dome down over her. And I am using the medium, I think it's the medium glass dome out of the assorted um, set that I got. So cute. And then once I get the uh, dome attached, I'm just going to add some of my dimensional butterflies to the outside of the container using glossy accents. And it turned out adorable. I mean, she's just so cute. I'm probably going to make her a couple of friends, too, um, <laughs> to put on the shelf next to her. And I love the tool on the back, how it covers up the, um, the back of this image. I love it. And so, like I said, I just grabbed some butter, uh, dimensional butterflies I had in my stash, and I attached them right to that glass dome using glossy accents. It works fine. And look at how cute it is. So I hope you all enjoyed this little tutorial. I hope you give it a try. You'll find all the links below um, in the description of my video. Thanks for watching, and leave me a comment and let me know what you think, everybody. See you on the next one.